Y254. Imagine. Welcome back to the broadcast. My name is Yvonne Anula. Tonight we talk about ideas for investment with Sylvia Apondi, who is CEO of a Sylvie Crew Cleaning Solutions. Remember, you can be part of our conversation tonight by simply tweeting us, beginning with the word Y News at Yvonne Anula254 channel. The hashtag to use is Y254 updates, beginning with the words Y News. Now, Sylvie, you're so much welcome to the broadcast tonight. Thank you. Uh, Sylvie, Sylvie Crew Cleaning Solutions. Yes. How did this start? Okay. Sylvie Cleaning Services, mm -hmm. which is um, abbreviated from Sylvie Inter Cleaning Company. Mm -hmm. It's a cleaning company mm -hmm. which started way in when I was still working with Sirma mm -hmm. Company and Advocates. Mm -hmm. I had a passion before I was also still working with Strami. Mm -hmm. Then from Strami, I went to, I started working with Sirma and Company Advocates. Mm -hmm. Uh, when I was working with Sirma, I had that passion. Mm -hmm. Before I had that passion, but mm. by that time, I wasn't like I had the ability, mm -hmm. like to move out or rather to have something that I can, that can help me out, mm -hmm. like also to to make the dream come to reality. Mm -hmm. So when I was work, working with Sirma and Company Advocates, mm -hmm. is when I, I started like looking on this thing deeper, mm -hmm. like. Yes, I have a passion for cleaning services. Mm -hmm. Why can't I try out this? So this is basically passion based. Yeah, it's passion based. You didn't go to school. No, like no, it, I never went to school. Mm -hmm. It All is right. something that is passion based. Mm -hmm. Let's yes. talk about capital. It's a major problem, especially when the young people want to start something. Uh, is this a business that I can start with a few coins? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a business that you can start with a few coins, with mm -hmm. whatever you have. Mm -hmm. You don't have like maybe must be saving like a lot of money or mm -hmm. rather be having a big capital for you to start. Mm -hmm. But it's something that you can start so long as you have passion. Mm -hmm. Passion is what will drive you to have maybe something bigger or rather something you are dreaming about mm -hmm. each and every day. Yes. So you have been in a position so far to employ. Uh, yeah. Do you employ young people or old people or it doesn't matter f so long as you know the job you are good to go okay personally mm -hmm. you it most people that i do employ they are young people mm -hmm. because young people they are self most of them they are self driven mm -hmm. there are people who like they are looking they are after they, are, they they really want to know as in they they want to build themselves mm -hmm. most of them mm -hmm. you'll find others they are part time students mm -hmm. You'll find others that are, that are just from Form 4. Mm -hmm. They're saving them some amount so mm -hmm. that they can also go to maybe mm -hmm. tertiary for mm -hmm. tertiary education. So most, most I can say, most of my employees, mm -hmm. they're young people. All right. So yes. I'm interested in knowing the uh, recruitment procedures that you use. Do you like have an agency that does this for you? No. Mm -hmm. What I do is we always have a training mm -hmm. that is based in an, or in our office we mm -hmm. have a training mm -hmm. most most of the time you have a training like you can have a training for two or three weeks mm -hmm. where people are trained uh how to use different kind of chemicals mm -hmm. where they are used mm -hmm. which kind of materials to be used mm -hmm. fpfs mm -hmm. and everything yeah maybe also you will find like you can employ some of the people that have not even mm -hmm. ever tried mm -hmm. out cleaning services, or rather mm -hmm. they have ever worked with cleaning services. Mm -hmm. So what you do, you have to teach this person how to handle a mop, mm -hmm. what to do, even the PR. We also do the training of PR, mm -hmm. like how they have to deal with the clients, mm -hmm. because we, ha we not only deal with maybe the common areas, but mm -hmm. we also deal with offices. Right. Yeah. Talking about people who come to you, mm -hmm. they know nothing, totally nothing about cleaning. Uh, how long does it take them to consume, you know, that information and be able to work with your machines and the detergents? The detergents. Mm -hmm. Okay, it, most especially mm -hmm. cleaning services, it's all about passion. Mm -hmm. Whether, most especially the person you find or rather the employees, mm -hmm. if someone is so much interested to work or rather mm -hmm. they know what they have come to do at work, mm -hmm. most of them, they won't take long. Like, yeah. If you, you can notice a person will take maybe one week mm -hmm. or rather three days, the person has already known a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Yes. So for the period that you've been in the industry, most young people, of course, go for white collar jobs. Yeah. Are young people really willing to take up this particular line of business? 
Not really. Mm -hmm. I haven't met a lot of young people who are really interested in taking this job. Mm -hmm. Yes, but I can tell young people to take this job mm -hmm. because it is it really needs young people because it is as in it really needs our minds, our strength, energy. People to have to move from one place to another. So it really needs young people so that they can move and do the business. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, talking of young people maybe being competent, mm -hmm. does that mean that the most uh, young people that you've employed, or not young people rather, mm -hmm. the most old people that you've employed are not that competent enough? Not that they're not competent enough. Mm -hmm. They are competent, I cannot say that they are not competent enough, mm -hmm. but at the same time, most especially you'll find like young people, these are jobs, you can move from one place to another, you can find like in a day, mm -hmm. you have like, like three jobs. So you need a group that will work from this place, mm -hmm. from after the first job, the first pound has ended, you go to another place, mm -hmm. you move to another place. Mm -hmm. So it is all about the energy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you find these people, they are not that much swift when the old people are not that, that much swift compared mm -hmm. to young people. Mm -hmm. How do yes. you do the coordinations? The coordination? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I do the coordinations. We have the field supervisors. We have also the um, people who are in charge, like the crew who will be in charge, mm -hmm. the field supervisors and the crew who is in charge. They are the people who monitor the, the work and maybe if at all there is any job that is an outside job that the people who monitor how people are going to work mm -hmm. the materials and everything all right sylvie maybe you can just give us an outline of how your days uh, uh, your day starts mm -hmm. and how maybe it ends okay my day mm -hmm. <laughs> okay my day starts as per the day that is supposed, it, the day starts different. Mm -hmm. I can say my Monday starts the way Tuesday will start. Mm -hmm. My Monday can start maybe from, as in with the field work. Mm -hmm. My Mondays can start with, a, a day can start with the field work, a day can start with being you being in an office, mm -hmm. or rather being in a, in a meeting. All right, let's yes. talk about this as far as uh, your job is concerned. My job is concerned. Mm -hmm. Most of the time I've taken, I'm taking note in field work, mm -hmm. like marketing. Mm -hmm. Personally, I'm the one who is marketing it. Most of the time, I'm the person who is marketing it. Mm -hmm. So most of my time, after I go to the office, what I do is marketing, mm -hmm. moving from one place to another, looking for tenders and business. All right, now let's talk about maybe customer relations. How have you been able to relate with your clients? Some maybe have gotten services that maybe didn't make them happy yes how do you deal with such cases um with cases like maybe the customer is unsatisfied Satisfied, yeah yeah the, those if you find a customer who is unsatisfied in fact you should take it as a a point for you to grow mm -hmm. because a person will come and tell you sylvia you haven't done this for me mm -hmm. or rather you haven't met the standards that i was looking for mm -hmm. that's the best client mm -hmm. so with such kind of a client what we do we have a guarantee. Mm -hmm. That's maybe our uniqueness or rather. That's we have a guarantee. If our job won't satisfy you, mm -hmm. we can redo it again. All right. Yes. So that deals uh, specifically with the uh, retaining of the customers? Yes, retaining of the customers. Mm -hmm. And also not only retaining of the customers, but mm -hmm. also ref the customer will refer you to other clients. All right. Yes. You have been in this line of business uh, for quite some time. Who are better, ladies or gentlemen? Ladies. <laughs> ladies, <Why>? ladies. <laughs> maybe it's just something that is inborn, I mm -hmm. can say, because ladies, they're the people who most especially they do cleaning of the <coughs> house, the cleaning, we just, like we just know from day one, the ladies are the people who are supposed mm -hmm. to be doing the cleaning and everything. Mm -hmm. But what I can say, ladies are the best. Mm -hmm. Ladies are the best when it comes to cleaning, All to right. come to those nitty gritty <coughs> things that are supposed to be mm -hmm. removed and everything. Yes. So let's go back to like Sylvie crew cleaning uh, solutions, what do you specialize with specifically? We specialize in cleaning of corporate places. Mm -hmm. We specialize in, we have specialized in cleaning of upholstery, mm -hmm. that is sofa deep clean, carpet deep clean. Mm -hmm. We also specialize in post-construction cleaning, <coughs> fumigation and pest control, industrial cleaning. Mm -hmm. We also specialize in one of cleaning that is maybe for comprehensive house cleaning or rather you just need a light cleaning of your house mm -hmm. yes talk to us about fumigation fumigation mm -hmm. 
Yes, fumigation, there's a difference between fumigation and pest control. Mm -hmm. Fumigation is what is done against maybe in an, in a, in an industrial place, mm -hmm. like those industrial things which are supposed to be exported. Mm -hmm. But pest control, this, this is a service that is done against the pest, mm -hmm. like co cockroaches, bed bugs, mice, yes. Uh, talk to us about maybe the challenges that you have seen so far in this line of business. In this line of business, yeah, there are, there, there are not a lot of challenges compared to advantages, mm -hmm. most especially as a youth. Youth were given like an upper hand compared to those other, maybe the other people who are like in this line of business, but mm -hmm. they are old. Because you, when you go to someone, maybe to a client, the client will prefer you as a youth mm -hmm. compared to someone else. All right. Yes, so as a youth, some of the challenges that I can say, maybe it's just exposure. Mm -hmm. Like for me, maybe if I go for someone, for a client who is more corporate, mm -hmm. will want to know how, as in the, the experience mm -hmm. that I've been in the, the, in the field, will also want to know if at all I've ever worked with a corporate company before, of which I, maybe, not maybe, or rather I, I can meet the, the standards of that place, mm -hmm. but because maybe I, have, I don't have experience, or rather I haven't worked with any corporate company, mm -hmm. I might be denied the job. All right, remember you can still be part of this conversation tonight, <coughs> rather, by simply tweeting us beginning with the word Y News at Yvonne Anula at Y254 channel. The hashtag to use is Y254 updates. Remember, we are talking about ideas for investment. So, Sylvia, um, let's talk about a young person that wants to start this kind of business. Mm -hmm. So, where do I start from the legal requirements to maybe customer satisfaction and so on? where you start like maybe business registration. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Take us through that. Okay, first of all, you must have, you, you, you have must register your business. Mm -hmm. No, you, you name such a business, mm -hmm. your business name. All right. If it goes through, mm -hmm. you register your business. Mm -hmm. It will depend on you if at all you register it as a limited or rather a limited liability or rather just a, as a business name. Mm -hmm. Then from there, you are good to go. It doesn't need a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, coming up with a name, like other instances where some names have been rejected, maybe simply because they are not that catchy enough or? Uh, a name won't be rejected because it is not catchy. Mm -hmm. A name will be re rejected because maybe someone else have already used it. Oh. Yeah. All right. So uh, in the next like three years, where do we expect to see Sylvie Crow uh, cleaning solutions? Uh, uh, Sylvie Crew in the next three years, mm -hmm. yes. It, uh, in the next three years, Sylvie Crew, um, I have a goal, like in the next three years we are going to be in East Africa, mm -hmm. she will be serving in East Africa, mm -hmm. not only in Kenya, because for now we are in Nakuru, we are in Limuru, mm -hmm. and also there is a client at Narok. Mm -hmm. But we are expecting in the next three years we should be out of Kenya, like in Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, and East Africa. Mm -hmm. Apart from that, I'm, I'm also having a passion of support services, mm -hmm. like maybe for transportation, like not only just dealing with office and messengerial, mm -hmm. but also having a support service mm -hmm. like that for delivery, like mm -hmm. maybe you can have a rider. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, what would you recommend the government uh, to support you uh, to like promote this particular sector? What I can say about the government mm -hmm. is to lower the, <laughs> the legal fees. Mm -hmm. Like for someone to do fumigation, there's mm -hmm. a fee that they have to pay. Which is how much? Like um, approximately 8,000. Mm -hmm. Yes, for someone to do garbage collection, mm -hmm. you know you have papers, but for you to transact that business, there's mm -hmm. a fee you have to pay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So maybe for even youth to feel like they can start a business or mm -hmm. rather and grow themselves, they should lower this legal prices. All right, now that you're talking about uh, Sylvie Crew, yes. what is unique about your business? Unique about my business? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of uniqueness about my business, of which I've already said. Mm -hmm. But there is a uh, uniqueness about my business is we are 24 hour in response. Other, other companies don't do that? <laughs> no, I to explain myself mm -hmm. about it. Mm -hmm. In that, mm -hmm. for us, we have people who are standby. Like if we are working for you, mm -hmm. maybe you have a problem with the beam, you have a problem with whatever services we are offering you. Mm -hmm. We can we can like we can respond in mm -hmm. the 
in the little time we can. Ah. Then something else about us mm -hmm. is we, we have tailor-made mm -hmm. structures or rather tailor-made services. Mm -hmm. We don't just go the, for a client because the client needs these, whatever we use on the other client, mm -hmm. that's, this is what is being used on the other client. No, we have tailor-made for each and every client. Mm -hmm. That means every client will meet as in We'll, we'll meet the expectation, mm -hmm. yes. So finally, as we wind up, is this a business that any young person out there can take up? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's a business that any young person can take up. Mm -hmm. So long as that, what cleaning needs is passion. Mm -hmm. That's what I can tell. So long as a person has passion, mm -hmm. the young person has passion, that I don't think even money is a problem. So long as a person has passion, the passion and the hard working. Mm -hmm. Because when you start, you really need have to be in the field right. rather in the office. Mm -hmm. Yes. So thank you so much, Sylvie, for coming through. Yeah, thank you. We really appreciate it. There has been a Sylvia Apondi, who is the CEO of Sylvie Crew Cleaning Solutions. And for her, it only takes a passion and you'll be good enough to go in this particular line of business. Thank you so much uh, for being with me and keeping me company tonight. My name is Yvonne and you enjoy the rest of your viewing. <laughs>